David Liguori with Liguori Drag Racing. In yesterday's video, I got a question about vertical interpolation and what is it, what does it do? So here's a video on vertical interpolation, horizontal interpolation, and just interpolation both ways. So here's a regular fuel map and this is done by throttle position, not manifold air pressure. You can do it either way. And I'm just going to take 100% here and I'm gonna multiply it. So I'm gonna add 80% of fuel to the top row of my fuel map. So you can see that it made a big jump here on the last row. Okay, so vertical interpolation is going to change from one point to another. It does not change your starting point, which right here is 30%, and it does not change our finish point here at 100%. It changes everything in the middle, so it'll change everything from 40% to 90%. And you'll see this snap up. So it'll be more of a straight linear line all the way across to the top here. So I'm gonna select that, click V. V is vertical interpolation, and that will snap up and change all these values here. Okay, so it made a straight linear line all the way across and made everything a lot smoother. I'm gonna undo that and I'm gonna take just about half of a table here on the right hand side. I'm gonna add 80% to this. We'll see this pop up here, just like that. And I'm gonna take from 5,000 RPMs over to 125 RPM, 1,500, 12, 12,500 RPMs. And I'm gonna click H, and this will snap up and be a linear line across there. H, okay. So that made a smooth transition all the way across to the upper uh, table here. I'm gonna undo that again, and I'm going to add multiply and I'm gonna add 90% to just this corner okay so it took that corner and made it just crazy high now I'm gonna take from 5,000 and 40% and I'm gonna drag all the way across to the corner and I'm gonna click I. I is just interpolation so it will do horizontal and vertical in the same move. So it took this up here and took this up here to make everything smooth to the top corner. You can do this on any kind of table, whether it be a 3D or a 2D table. So your fuel map, your ignition table, your engine start settings. Uh, see the engine start here, how it's a little goofy. If you wanna smooth that out, select from your starting point to your end point and click H and that will smooth that out. your nitrous duty cycle. Uh, I wanna start at 20%, but this pass, I wanna drag it out a little bit more. So I'll drag it out to four seconds. Click H and that will snap down. I wanna start at 50% here. See how that's kinda goofy, you don't wanna Start at 50% and then drop back down. 
So we'll drag across, click H, and all that will snap up. Same thing with a boost table, wastegate control table. Let's drop the boost out of here. So it's gonna make about seven pounds of boost, then go up, and we don't want this. So let's drag from seven seconds, 15.33 wastegate. And let's come down to 12.9 at 2.2 seconds. Click H, all this will snap down, just like that. So you can see, also when I change the main value here, it changes the table here. So it makes it look a little different. So let's add this, let's add wastegate to it, and you'll see this climb. And then take this and smooth it out just like that. So there's an example of vertical interpolation, horizontal interpolation, and just straight interpolation. So I hope this answers the question. If you have any more questions, leave them down in the comments below. Like, subscribe. I appreciate you guys.